everyone. I am here today to show you how to make these cool art pieces. They are really simple, they are really fun, they're super gratifying, and um, I'm gonna show you all the steps. This one is made with acrylic paint with art resin over top. This one is done with tinted art resin and resin tint. And basically it's just a wooden panel that's got drywall compound on top to give it that texture. So stay tuned, I'm gonna show you all the steps and I dare you not to make 50 of these, they are so fun. <laughs> Once I let the wallboard compound harden overnight, the next step was to breathe some life into these pieces with some color to really make them pop. So I used acrylic paint for the first technique and then I coated the whole thing in a nice, even coat of art resin. to the next piece. For the second piece, I wanted to mimic the color palette of the first one, but I wanted to do a totally different technique. So I used resin tint and I tinted the art resin, poured it in each segment and just spread it out to where exactly I wanted it to go. Check that out. So both of these pieces I think are really strong. They're similar and yet different. The first piece is opaque. The colors are very vibrant, especially under that art resin, it really makes them pop. The second piece it has more transparency to it. It has sort of a watercolor effect and the colors are definitely less saturated. I think they're both really beautiful. So there you have it. It really is as simple as it looks and I think if you try it out for yourself, you are gonna just see how, how fun it really is. So, I have a tip for you. On this piece, you can see that some of the red tint ran into the brown and kind of made not a really defined line right there. Here's what I would do next time to correct that. Make sure that you dig really deep in as you draw out your shape. That will create a nice deep cavity for the resin to sit in and it'll also create a ridge for the red to sit in between and you won't have some of this running color like you see here. Whichever way you choose, if you choose to go the tinted art resin versus the acrylic paint with art resin over top, I think both results are really cool. This one's really opaque, this one is more watercolory. it just depends on what you like. Try it both ways, you will love it, I promise. Mm -hmm.